Hey, I'm Ken Smith, and I'm with two new friends I've made here. Tell them your name. Lucas. 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 Well, tell me, Mickey. Uh, Mickey, did you get? You told me that when the water was coming up, you had to get on a helicopter. How was that? Was it scary? No. Had you ever been on a helicopter before? No. What do you think about all that you see that's going on? You don't know. How old are you? Six. Six years old. Four. Four. Well, I just want to tell you, a lot of people are praying for you guys and love you. Okay. All right. Have y'all? Did y'all get those Mickeys from someone? Did someone give that to you? Yep. They did. And then they got a lot of other supplies. We're going to try to help bring more out here. So we love you and just wanted everyone to see who you were, okay? Uh-huh. Okay, bye-bye. Say bye. Bye. <laughs>
Hey, this is Ken Smith. I'm here with one of my new friends and a fellow uh, member of the Body of Christ. Tell them who you are. My name is Alberta Pugh Hudson. And Miss Hudson, I know she's still got a smile on your face, but for what you were telling me earlier, you had a lot of damage. Um, yes, tell us about what happened there at your home again. Well, the, well, I live on eight foot piling, so I guess with the deck and everything else, the foundation of it would be about 15 feet in the air. And the water had came up to the deck by the time the Coast Guard came and picked us up with the helicopter. And I, I just never would have thought the water would get up like that. And then when they came and assessed the home, they could see where the water had actually gotten in the home. Now tell us the church right here, what kind of damage? Um, I know you're here volunteering and helping. Yeah. Um, um, we're here at Sand Hill right. A&E and e Church. Yes. And what, this, and what happened here? This is my home church. And the water, this is actually the second time that the water has come all the way up. To the ease of the, of the building there. The building, yes, sir. And then, so the inside of it's completely, yeah, it's completely it's, destroyed. And yes, sir. Yes, I noticed sir. that guys in yellow shirts, North Carolina Baptist men, are in there tearing yes, out. Yes, and, sir. And and some of the local, um, I think actually they have a crew from Baltimore that has come down. I mean, just the, it's just the love and the unity of the people that's that 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 has kept a smile on my face I would say that it's just the love that's been shown by the people that has really kept a smile on my faith and increased my faith. Well I just want to thank you for what you're doing and I know that your church that you minister at has also been affected over in Duplin County yes. and we're going to try to get some assistance there as well so just want to let you know that we love you praying for you and those that are watching this I pray that they'll also be praying for not only you but also for the congregation here, you'll notice that just so much damage, every home that's been affected here. So thank you once again. Thank you. Thank you. God bless.